Hey everybody. Um, so it's something a little bit different. Um, as the title will, will, will tell you, um, I got a new chair. Now this is not the new chair. This is my old chair. The chair I'm currently using. Oh, it hurts to kneel on this hard floor. That's my knees. Um, but I, I, I work from my computer for a living from home and, um, I'm sitting all day and I've, I've had this for probably 10, 11, possibly 12 years. Um, and it's kind of amazing. I didn't buy one sooner, but I like to, I don't like to replace things until they fall apart. And this, okay. I, I warn you, this is scary. Okay. This is going to be scary. Um, <laughs> it's pretty disturbing, but this is, Oh, this is what I've been sitting on whenever I've been streaming. Look at this. Check this out. All of the faux leather has been worn off over the years. It's always flaking onto the floor. Um, yeah, just completely, completely worn. This is like almost just down to like metal and plastic. So my butt just hurts sitting on it. It's, it's not padded at all. It hasn't been padded for a long time. And then recently, this has been starting to like fall apart. You know, it's just, you see, it's just like plastic and whoops. So I finally got a new chair. Um, I was originally going to get a ergonomic chair, like a, like a Herman Miller, but they're like, they're like 2,500 bucks. And I even looked at used ones, but the used ones are still like a thousand bucks or more. And anyways, I ended up getting a chair that I tried in the store and then I ordered it online because it was like 200 bucks cheaper online. Anyways, I am going to put it together now. Um, I believe it's called, yeah, it's a, it, it is a gaming chair. It's not an ergonomic chair, but I did try it. And like it and it has really good reviews um so it's the anda dark knight gaming chair and i'll put the affiliate link in the description to make lots of monies okay but uh yeah so i'll probably edit the video so that you don't have to watch this in real time because that would be that would suck <laughs>
Okay, so I actually put half of this together two weeks ago, and then the instructions that came with it are incorrect. I don't know if they gave me the wrong set or what, but they assumed that the armrests were already installed, which they weren't, and so I thought that they had forgotten to give me some parts um, and uh, contacted support, blah, 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 blah. Um, uh, long story short, I have all the correct parts, but yeah, the instructions were completely incorrect. So uh, here I am two weeks later putting the second half together um, and yeah. that I've got audio recording too. So these go up and down and they also go, um, they're supposed to be other one. And then there is a, oh, this one is. There's another thing here. So these, these can also go in and out like this. And I'm not sure what this one does. This one, you can also go here. So I'll kind of think of that. Go out, in, and then these go in and out, and then up and down. So three, three adjustments for each of these. Ooh, these are a little high though. Take me a while to get used to the. That's kind of high. And this is kind of low. Hmm. Oh, that's gonna be weird. My other. Well, it depends how I. This is high. Okay, it's not bad. And um. Okay, and then this. There's a lever here.
very comfortable. I'm not sure about these on the legs. It's a little encompassing. But I often sit. Oh, I often sit. Well, I often sit like this <laughs> half the time. Um, maybe not half the time, but I do sit cross-legged. Okay, and then there's supposed to, and then the adjustments here. So that's the height behind. Okay. And then this one is leisure mode. I don't know what that is. I'd have to look into that more. Leisure mode. Was oh, that what this is maybe? Or no, I have to look into what that does. But I'll have to get used to it. it. It is, it is comfortable. I might change the wheels to, the wheels I have on my old chair are roller blade, uh, roller blade wheels, which, um, I highly recommend. Like you can upgrade any office chair. You just buy roller, roller blade wheels, and um, just put them on, put them onto the bottom, and they're the rubber. It's really good if you have hardware floors because they're completely silent and they won't mark up your floor, and they roll really easy. Um, so I might replace those with my old ones and, uh, um, I'll have to get used to it. It's, it's a big change. I've had my old chair again for like 10 years. Uh, it, it's comfortable. The only thing I'm not sure about is again, here, kind of close to my leg, it, 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 like it's, it's a little bit tight. I don't know. I'm used to it being completely flat there, so oh, that'll, that'll take some getting used to. But everything up here is really, really comfortable. The, um, the, whole, the whole backrest is, this is all very comfortable here. And there's the lumbar support here, and then like a headrest is quite comfortable. Um, yeah, it's just, in, it's just down here. Anyway, that's my new chair. It's, it makes a little bit of noise when I roll. So again, I might change those caster wheels to roller blade wheels. Okay, new chair.